Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Before we start, please like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. Britain's Prince Harry is penning an intimate and honest memoir that will expose the mistakes and lessons learned across his life, publisher Penguin Random House said Monday. The announcement comes at a time of strained relations between Harry and the British royal family amid allegations by his wife Meghan of bullying and royal racism, and the couple's shock move to the United States last year. It will be the first time a senior British royal has ever written such a book, according to British media reports. I'm writing this not as the prince I was born, but as the man I have become, said Prince Harry in a statement published by Penguin Random House. I've worn many hats over the years, both literally and figuratively, and my hope is that in telling my story, the highs and lows, the mistakes, the lessons learned, I can help show that no matter where we come from, we have more in common than we think. I'm deeply grateful for the opportunity to share what I've learned over the course of my life so far and excited for people to read a first-hand account of my life that's accurate and wholly truthful. Unveiling the plans on Twitter, the giant New York-based publishing house described the book, scheduled for late next year as an intimate and heartfelt memoir from one of the most fascinating and influential global figures in our time. The book will cover his childhood. Harry was just 12 years old when his mother, Prince Diana, died in a Paris car crash, as well as his military service, including two tours of Afghanistan. The honest and captivating personal portrait will also recount the joy he has found in being a husband and father, according to the publisher. The title appears to refer to the saying, hair and spare linked to the firm, dating back from less healthier times when it was considered safer for the continuation of the line to have at least two children should anything happen to the firstborn. As it was already announced in July last year, the Duke will donate his proceeds from spare to charity. The website dedicated to Harry's book stated the royal wishes to support British charities with his donations. It then announced St. Bale which the Duke co-founded in 2006 in support of vulnerable children in Lesotho, had already received £1.5 million, while Harry's beloved patronage Wellchild, which supports families with children battling life-limiting illnesses, will be given £300,000. Many commentators were quick to react to the news regarding the Duke's memoir, including talk TV host Piers Morgan. Taking to Twitter, the known critic of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex said, Confirmed, Prince Privacy will hurl his latest torrent of malevolent money-making muck at the royal family just in time to ruin his father's coronation as king. Charles should strip this petulant, selfish, greedy, hypocritical brat of all his remaining royal titles slash status ASAP. The Daily Mirror's Russell Myers, referring to the title, tweeted, Lordy, I wonder whose decision the title was. The former BBC royal correspondent, Peter Hunt, also commented on the title saying, The power and the pathos of one word. Fans of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, on the other hand, reacted with excitement to the news shared by the book publisher. Twitter user AG said, So it was true. I can't wait to read this book I've been waiting for ages. Another Zandy added, Wow, what a powerful title. Can't wait to read it. We'll be getting multiple copies for family and friends. So what do you think about this news, guys? Please, share your personal opinion with us in the comments section below. Thank you.